This is a Jacob's Lantern. It's basically two wires and electrical arc between them and the heat from the arc makes it climb up the wires and then the wires kind of V out like so. And that then the distance increases at some point the voltage can't sustain the arc and then it breaks and repeats at the bottom because that's the arc is basically trailing power and the thing underneath there is called an oil burner ignition transfer that's like an oil furnace they use that to ignite the fuel and some people call it an obit you put 120 volts into it and the side there in that white wire and then when you see the arc that's 10,000 volts or 10 kilovolts Kilo means a thousand, so 10 kV would be 10,000 volts. And then in my case, I just use Variac to control it. Down here, if I turn the light on, you see it. I have, in this case, in my wiring, I don't have it quite perfect for a 120 setup, so I got to adjust it to like about 138 volts for it to work well. And this allows me to adjust it, fine tune it, things like that. But that's how I'm, that's a Jacob's Ladder. Looks a little cool in the dark though. And you can probably hear the hum of the transformer and you can hear the arc as it starts and breaks and things. The pop is the arc breaking or creating. And then I can turn the voltage up a little bit. Or I can turn it down. And then you get shorter arcs because it doesn't, it voltage breaks off sooner. Or it doesn't work. I mean, it's probably about 100 watts there and it's working again. That's pretty decent. But it's still not as good. Occasionally I'll get to the top of the wire at the very top, but you can't see that right now though. But that's a Jacob ladder. And this doesn't have much power so it doesn't melt the wires, it's just a couple of copper wires out of a piece of Romax basically.